Yo, in today's video, we'll be looking at unbelievable events on TikTok that are happening all over the world. Bro, what the, what is this? It's, it's like, it's like cream corn Yo. from the sky. What the hell Imagine is going that. on? Sweet baby Jesus brought us his cream corn. It's a damn malfunction in the weather machine. Come on, Mr. Musk, what is going on over here? It's chemtrail. That's weird. Snap. I'm about this to do leaf. what the <laughs> This leaf is spinning in mid-air. This leaf is spinning in mid-air, bro. What how can you explain it's that? In mid -air. I'm not crazy. I'm not crazy. It's still just spinning and spinning and spinning. They ain't put it in slow motion. It just slowed down. What the? Yeah, I've seen this. The birds are not real before. Like, I've seen... They had, like, a whole... Whoa, what's this? Are they letting the birds out? Oh, snap. <clears throat> Yo, they saying they're drones? Birds, man. I don't have to They're trying to break through the firmament, y'all. This one of those uh, what, uh, SpaceX rockets or whatever. Look at that. That looked crazy. It looked like it's stuck, right? And it's hitting something and it can't get through. And it's sending these waves through. Or it's like in some type of water or something. That's crazy looking, though. It's definitely not natural. Rain cloud and trumpet sounds over Israel. Look at that rain note. Whoa. Yo, it's been a lot of these sightings. Rings in the sky. Man, what they got going on over there, y'all? Look, man, it'd be some crazy stuff going on in our world, right? And isn't it just messed up how us as natural, regular, everyday beings, right? We got to go every day and just guess what it could be because no one's going to tell us. They do all this stuff behind our back. Clearly, something's going on here. This isn't natural. You're not going to just randomly see a ring cloud in the sky. Something's going on, but we don't know. You know, they could be testing something, something with the frequencies in the area, and we won't know. We won't know how it affects us either. So it's just wild that uh, <laughs> we got to like we got to go to TikTok to find out what's going on. Ain't that crazy? Oh, listen. Oh, look at that. What is that? That look crazy. never seen nothing like this before. Hey, why the water moving like that? They don't seem concerned enough. Scenes in Australia right now. Parts of the country experience devastating flooding. Look at that. Man, I'd be scared to live on the coast. 
You never know what's going to hit you. These are mosquitoes after the flooding in Australia. No way. That's all mosquitoes. Yo, have y'all seen this though? Like animals randomly walking in circles? Something's up with that. They know more than we do. They can sense things that we can't. This even what's that? Oh, they oh look at that! Someone calls and they all start going in circles. So, is there something going on with the frequencies, the radio frequencies in the sky and the atmosphere, to so where the animals can sense it and it's making them go in circles like that? Yo, you see how they're walking in circles? Da da da. What if these frequencies? And I'm I'm reaching right here, but what if these frequencies? kind of have an effect on us as well. Just not the same, you know, we're not gonna sit there and just walk in circles, but we're going to go in circles mentally. You know, we're gonna keep doing the same things, we're gonna keep being stuck in these cycles, right? Still doing the same thing and our mind goes in circles. And what if these frequencies are what's stopping us from actually being true to who we are? You know what I'm saying? To, to break that, uh, that cycle. That's a crazy thing to think about. So this is after a 7.8 earthquake in near the Euphrates. This looks like uh, the end of Endgame or something. This looks wild, don't it? So millions of people are potentially at risk. This is big breaking news Acid another chemical massive spill? chemical oh, spill wow. has happened and you should evacuate if you are in this area hydrophoric acid which can literally melt your skin and bones off has been spilled into this creek that leads into a lake that eventually flows into the mississippi river so millions of people Bruh. are potentially at risk of being exposed to this chemical and there's been a massive leak and there's barely any coverage on this once again how are these chemicals leaking into our waterways and why does this keep happening as well so the spill happened right outside of memphis tennessee it's actually inside of mississippi though at the musacuna creek and this creek actually flows into the arkabutla lake and then the lake has a dam and a outlet that has a massive flow into the Mississippi River as well. It flows all the way down to Vicksburg, right outside of Jackson, Mississippi, and eventually runs into the Mississippi River. So what exactly is happening here? Why do these toxic chemicals keep spilling into our waterways and potentially threatening our farmland as well, threatening farm animals, killing animals, and killing people, all right? There are people in Ohio reporting. Be careful, Kali. That's, that's crazy, right? Uh, these these spills and, you know, it's just crazy. The cities, you know, the ones in Memphis, you know, Memphis is supposedly, you know, an ancient city. They got a lot of Egyptian artifacts in Memphis. You know, the name Memphis, they've even got one in, you know, over there in Africa and Egypt or whatever. And then the other one was Ohio, East Palestine and, you know, Palestine over there too. I don't know, man. It's just could just be coincidences but doesn't seem like it to me it's probably something a lot deeper to that this one says be careful cali hey everybody this is Dal Arnson with the alaska patriot network i am visiting california and i am here with one of the local ranchers and i was brought out to this field in stanislaw county california and this is the center of like the heartland of the, the nut industry, the almond industry, the pecan, or not pecans, I'm sorry, almond, walnut, uh, cattle. Uh, there's not a lot out here, folks. And yesterday we were at a gathering and we were alerted by another rancher that the railroad company 
some company they, that nobody knows which company this mm. is has brought in hundreds of these railroad cars and you can just see the line of them here let me see it make sure i'm getting it in the shot sorry getting this in the shot now it, on the on the cars they say liquid odorless liquid petroleum gas now Ooh. they are loaded the, the they're riding low on their axles they're double and triple deep on the switchback and and this is important because these ranchers this is unprecedented in this area no, none of them they're like what the hell is this why are they bringing this into the you know heart of nowhere i mean unless you own land here or you're in the know-how you don't know that this is this is here right now yo what do y'all think they're trying to do with these uh these trains what's been happening everywhere mm, and, and like she said this is like the the cattle the ranch area the you know what i'm saying the fruit and nuts or whatever and that's what they make there so why would they bring these here what are they trying to do y'all i mean i could i could kind of guess but i ain't gonna say it i'm gonna let y'all come to that conclusion and like i said this is just the end of this line i gonna make sure i'm getting these cars in here and it goes on for miles there's hundreds mm. of these cars filled with an unknown liquid in the middle now what's significant about this is just over you know a few miles over is the main water pipeline that goes into san See? francisco this mm. also abuts two important industri uh, in agricultural uh, rivers that feed this agricultural valley so we don't quite know what's going on here and it was the talk of the valley yesterday i'm, I'm just visiting from alaska so i did ask one of the ranchers to bring me out here are a couple more videos of that fire that we were flying over this oh, morning this is, in Chicago wow, Heights. So is that a manufacturing facility at 11th and Washington? And just look at all of that smoke coming from that area. Um, thankfully, hearing no injuries involved in this fire, but crews are still on the scene. And take a look at this. This is the view as we that. were approaching about 15 miles away. <laughs> Just stop after it tears all the chairs apart. So. Dang. Look, all this stuff happening all over the world, right? Not once have I seen anything about this in any mainstream news outlet, right? I never knew that this was going on in Saudi or any of this stuff, right? So, like I said earlier, it's crazy. You got to come to TikTok to see these things. But yeah, this reminds me of, you know, if you're into the Tartaria and into the mud floods, you know, you see things like that. It just makes it make that much more sense, right? Man, cars just floating away like it's a river. Hey, y'all watch out if y'all, you know, trying to buy a car from a used car dealership, you might be buying one of these cars and it's not, you're not going to get any car facts on that. You know what I'm saying? Your car just got flooded in the Saudi, but we'll give you a great deal if you give us $2,000 down. Ya Rabb, Ya Rabb, Ya Rabb, Ya Rabb. 
يا رب ارفع عنا غضبك يا رب ارفع غضبك يا رب ارفع غضبك يا رب ارفع غضبك يا رب ارفع غضبك يا رب يا رب ارفع غضبك Can anybody tell me what she's saying? Because she keeps repeating it. يا ناس الدفاع المدني يا ناس يا رب ارفع غضبك يا رب ارفع غضبك يا رب Probably saying this is crazy. يا رب here oh look at that look the whole end of the island is falling off why are they just standing there like they won't fall off with it just swallow the whole tree and that's probably happened so many times in our life well, not our lifetime but the lifetime of this earth like you know how you go to beaches right and you know you look at the side of the beach and there's this huge rock wall but at the top it's flat you know you always wonder like man how did this get created it's probably something like this there's probably more land and it fell off into the ocean somewhere some of the most unbelievable events happening all over the world if you like the content don't forget to subscribe turn your notification bell on and until next time youtube peace